What has happened to the human voice? Vox humana. Hollering, shouting, quiet, talking, buzz. I was leaving the airport. This is in Atlanta. You know, you, you leave the gate, you take a train that took you to concourse of your choice, and I get into this train, dead silence, a few people seated, all standing. Up above you hear a voice that once was a human voice, but no longer. Now it talks like a machine. Concourse 1, Fort Worth, Dallas, Lubbock, that kind of voice. Just then the doors are about to close, nomadic doors, when a young couple rush in and push open the doors and get in. Without missing a beat, that voice above says, because of late entry, we delayed 30 seconds. The people looked at that couple, as if that couple just committed mass murder, you know. And the couple is shrinking like this, you know. And I'm known for my talking. I'm, I'm Gabby. And so I say, George Orwell, your time has come and gone. I expect a laugh. Dead silence. And now they look at me. And I'm with the couple, the three of us, at the Hill of Calvary on Good Friday. And then I say, my God, where's the human voice? And just then there's a little baby. Maybe the baby's about a year old or something. And I say, sir or madam, to the baby. What is your opinion of the human species? Well, what does a baby do? And the baby starts giggling. I say, thank God. The sound of a human voice. Mm-hmm.